my channel. Obviously, my friends, you know. In today's video, I just can obviously a title is going to be a back to school supply haul slash like no, it's gonna be back to school shopping slash back to school haul because you know I I might take you guys on with me if we go to Walmart. So, but right now we're about to go to my grandparents' house to wash clothes, and then there's a Walmart over there. So hopefully, my sister can take me over there. So I can get some school supplies and I have a list. So I guess I'm gonna tell you guys my list right now. So, like I made a list on Target, Walmart. But we might go to Walmart because it's closer and it's cheaper. So on my list I just have one a three inch binder. My mom told me to get some divider tabs, gra a graphic notebook, graph paper notebook for um, you know, math class because I wanna be a static with using machine and my notes have my, my notes really nice. And I want to get board, so like, if you have to, like, jot down a question that doesn't have to be on paper, we, like, we could just erase it. That would just be easier, so we could also save paper. I need some earbuds, because obviously we're going to be online, so I need to get some earbuds. And I have AirPods, but my AirPods can't connect to my computer, so. And then the last thing I want to get are some Crayola gel pens, because somebody in 7th grade last year, took them out of my pencil case and they stole almost all of them. I have a three like, I don't know. Hopefully they just get by them or whatever. So yeah, let's go back to school shopping. This is a quick summary, but yeah. About to go back to school shopping. What time is it? It's like eight something or nine. Yes. It's really late. So hey guys, now we are back from Walmart and it's actually been like two days because the last clip you guys saw, my sister's boyfriend took me to Walmart because he like promised to take me. And it was like eight o'clock when we went last night. So yeah, and we had to kind of rush because it closed at 10, so yeah. And I didn't really want to film anyway because there was people in there and I felt really awkward, but I did film a little bit, but the video was like choppy and it's all weird, so I didn't put it in there, so. Now let's get to the haul. So first I just wanted to say that this is from, I think this is from Walmart. But my mom went to Walmart like last month and she got me this. I'm pretty sure she got me this because I'm the only one that really likes ombre colors like this. But she got me this lunchbox. I don't know why because we're not going to go back to school unless we do go back. Because I know we're going to, I think we're doing like the first month or two online. And then we might go back, I don't know. But yeah, she got me this ombre colored lunchbox and it's pink, purple, and blue. And this is really cute. It's kind of similar to the one I had last year. And also, me and my mom got like matching hydro flask. And I'm just including this because this is basically back to school. When you go back to school, you need a water bottle. We're doing online, but you still need to drink water. And guys, the first time I drank out of this, I thought you opened it this way. But no, it does this way. So, yeah, that's empty right now. But my mom, she just has, like, a blue ombre one, like, a dark blue ombre one. And I just have the, like, teal, pink, and purple. So, my theme for back to school, as you can probably tell now, is going to be pastel. So, this, my theme was inspired by these two. I wanted everything to match. And then, I know we're going to be on, have online school. So I didn't need to get a new backpack. Well, I really wanted to get a new backpack. I wanted to get like or a um, Nike backpack, but she told me not to get a backpack because we went to Dick's Wearing Goods, yeah. And they were like fifty dollars, and I was like, no. So I'm just gonna reuse this backpack because I will be going to my dad's house, or like if I want to go to my best friend's house or to like a sleepover, and we do schoolwork because you know online, I can just put all my schoolwork in here. And I had this backpack, this. I don't even know. That's it. Frau Raven Kinky Backpack since like the middle of sixth grade because I got it like in December of sixth grade. And I used it ever since the middle of sixth grade, seventh grade, and now I'm going to use it this year. And it's like really minimalist to me. It's just a classic size. It's not that beat up. So. So we're doing online, like I said, twice already. And I don't really need a lot of school supplies, so I honestly only got five things, like I said the beginning of the video so first don't attack me or anything but i just got two binders because my mom told me to get a three or four inch binder 
and we honestly couldn't find any three inch binders so i just got two one and a half inch binders which i never get more than one binder so this is kind of weird to me but i just wanted them because they go with my aesthetic and like they're really comfortable like, I, I just love them and honestly i might not need both of them but i have like 12 classes i don't know why i'm going to eighth grade so i honestly don't know why i need i have 12 classes they might split them or something so i just have two one and a half inch binders I have this like purple one and this like bluish two one i don't know and this is what it looks like i never bought a binder this color before it always has a pocket one that's why i don't really care going with the binders i just got one pack of um clear like dividers it's an eight pack and i know i have two binders but and there's like eight dividers so i might have like four divider tabs in each binder to make it like eight six, whatever and i'm not gonna set my binders up yet because i don't know anything the only thing i know about my school is what time we wake up which literally we wake up normal time which is 8 a.m yeah but yeah we wake up at 8 a.m and school ends at 2:40, so they might change that i don't know yet yeah. a lot to you know i did not get a lot of stuff I really wanted to get a dry erase book, not a dry erase book, a dry erase board. I can like have less waste, and now we have like these little eight eight dollars, which is super 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 dry erase markers. But I didn't feel like it's a plan, so whatever. But I got a grid notebook from math class because last year I just like to write aesthetic notes down, and then I just started I started using it as math notes. And I know my handwriting is not that aesthetically pleasing; it's really messy, but. To be, I like writing in um pencil because pens smear sometimes and it just messes me up, so. But yeah, I just got this good notebook and yeah, I just have like a little page for it. Because we're 100 sheets, so. This will be for math. Also for notes, these are the only type of pens I got because, like I said at the beginning of the video, somebody stole my Crayola pens and we was looking for them at Walmart, but we couldn't find any, so I just got these. Hopefully they like, are good i don't think i tried these before they're just the paper paper mate enjoy ballpoint pens and it comes with 16 and these were literally so cheap all my school supplies is affordable especially if we go to walmart but these were like 488 i think and i just i just realized it comes with like two of each color so me my mom and my sister because and then, like, I never get these, but this year I decided to get them because they were just so cute. Match with my theme, you know? Like, note-taking, and you put them on their planners to, like, organize their notes or whatever. So, I just got two post notes, and they were cheaper to get them separate. So, it was, like, a dollar something each. So I just got a teal or, like, a mint blue and, like, this light purple one. I just got some earbuds and, oh, backwards. But a lot to you not. The ones that they had, like, hooked on the things... They were 10 something and I'm like, I'm not paying $10 for no earbuds and I did not pay, my sister's boyfriend paid. Thank you, cause I was about to take my money out. But yeah, I just got these earbuds and I also had a gift card that my mom gave me that had $10 on it. So we only paid like 20 something. But I honestly, my mom has a pair at her job, but I was like, you might as well just keep those if you're gonna need those at your job. So I just got my own because I will need these for online. I still have a lot more stuff to go through. The stuff that I found. But for like starters for the stuff that I found, I didn't buy this. I got this as like a birthday gift. So I just got the thing. So let me just, I don't know if I should do a what's in my pencil case right now, but I will just do it. I, honest, I didn't get any highlighters because I have some from literally 6th through 7th grade, whatever. So I have these Crayola erasable highlighters. I'm missing a pink one. I just have, I should really take some of these out, but I have. These mild or mid liner, like markers slash highlight, like highlighters, and they're double sided, so. Yeah. And then I should, I'm just having a mechanical pencil, and I literally did not get any pencils because I have so many from, you know, I have a, I have a whole bucket full of pencils. I have a Ty Rongo, however you say it. And then I have these pens, but I got these for Christmas, and they're cheap, and I, I'm not, I'm sorry, but I don't really like these. Because some of them don't work, so I don't like them, so I just had, I had to get the paper made ones. Paper, yeah, I had to get those. So I just have all of these pencils. And it would have been a waste of money to get brand new ones, you know? So yeah, I just have like at least two of these left to finish. And then in my last compartment, I just have these erasable pens that I don't really necessarily like. Because they write really hard. But I just have these from Amazon. 
literally everything in here is like from Amazon, except for like the pencils. I had this eraser. Yeah. I didn't have to buy a new eraser. And then I have that. Yeah. But that's all that's in my pencil case. And then like I said, like going by, I didn't need to buy any more pencils. I also got highlighters off of Amazon. From all of I found... So we went to my grandparents house the other day and I found tape and I was like, oh, we need tape. And instead of wasting money and buying it, I just took that tape. Yeah, like, because I had this Pushy tape dispenser that's kind of, yeah, out of tape. So I'm going to put a brand new pack in here. But I don't even think we're going to need tape, but just in case. Or just to have this somewhere. I didn't need to buy a planner. Not planner, but that too. But I didn't need to buy a folder because have this pocket it's a document holder if we have any loose leaf papers which we probably will i could just use this and it's from walmart that we got like last year and we just never use it have that got this last year from staples we literally went to staples at walmart last year so we had my calculator if you're wondering why you didn't see any notebooks yet here i found these in my school supplies bin because i have like a school supplies bin that i just went through and decluttered with so these notebooks don't really go with my theme, except for this color. But I doubt I'm going to need both of these. So I think for the school, the school year, I'm going to use this one. And I did have to use one of these for Spanish. And I used these for, like, sixth grade. But I only use like, two pages. So that's my name. This one, I'm not going to use. So. Then I found this three-subject notebook from last year that I didn't use. Because I don't really like three-subject notebooks. Because to me... They're really bulky, but I'm my dad got me this mouse because he thought I was going to need it for my computer. Literally. So, yeah, I just have a mouse that I might... Yeah, I plan on using it this year because I didn't have to use it last year, so... And then, me... My, so, my grandmother took me and my cousin to the Dollar, like dollar General, and my cousin got some stuff. And I really wanted these because everybody on TikTok had them to write notes with. And I need a new marker, so I was like, let me just get these. And they were only, like, $4. And at Target, they're, like, 6 so I thought they were, like, a steal. And it comes with 20 so I just got these. And then I also found these. They're from Staples. They're reinforcement tabs to put in the binder, you know, for the paper. So, I have paper, you know. I didn't have to buy this because I have a 500 pack of paper, and then I have a brand new pack of paper. So, I'm going to divide this and put it into my binders. I have more if I need some. I put that in my binder too. I didn't have to buy erasers because I have some erasers. Like, I'm not going to show all of them, but I have pe pencil top erasers. I have these. This one is brand new from last year that I never used. So, I have these. Pushing eraser. I have more, like a four pack of these too. And I have this big eraser from like fifth grade, I think. I used to have two, but yeah. I was backwards. So, yeah, just Obviously, you guys. I'm doing online school, so it's like, what? This is a must-have. I just have my computer, and no joke, I, I haven't had this that long. I got it in, like, May, like, April, May, because that's when we started doing online school. Like, I had a computer prior that, like, my dad gave it to me, and it was, like, kind of bad. It didn't really work so well. So my mom was like, I'm going to just buy you a computer, and this was, like, three or $400. But she was like, you're going to need it, because if you do online school, you're going to need a computer, so... It's just a um, HP white computer. My mom has a black one for work. So I wanted to be aesthetically pleasing whenever I'm in like Visco and put some stickers on it. But I made stickers because I'm cheap. So that one just has my name. This one says happy. Yeah, they're really cheap looking. But yeah. And it's Chrome HP. And also, guys, I start school in less than nine days. I go back to school September 8th. People thought this was like, what's it called? Shaving cream, but it's hand sanitizer. It smells so good. So yeah. So now I'm about to just put everything inside of my backpack that was just not all scattered through my, throughout my room. And it's easy to go through. And when I finally get to organize it, I will. Because I, like I said, I don't know anything about my, like, classes yet. Because no, the teachers have told us anything about school yet. So, I'm just going to put everything in my backpack. And, like, try to organize it as best as possible. So, so like, guys, now, 
my backpack is pretty stuffed and it's really heavy. Like, I don't even think this is how my backpack was last year. Oh, because I didn't have two binders. Like, last year, I just had one binder, two notebooks, a pencil case, and, like, I'm trying to be really minimal, but, like, I ha I brought stuff, and I had stuff that I already had, so it was, like, but I just try to put, I try to fit everything in here for right now, and I will be reorganizing this, and, yeah. Oh, it's heavy. So, yeah. Like, I might not even need the two binders, but... So yeah, that's basically all that I have for my school supplies. I might do a what's in my backpack video. Like I might, might not because you guys can already see what I have. But everything in here isn't what I'm going to keep in here because I'm not going to walk around with this big heavy back backpack if I need to or whatever. But yeah, I might also film a first, a first. I might film a first day of all my school morning routine video and a night routine video. Hopefully, by like next week, it's like two weeks from now, probably. Because I go back to school September 8th, as I said, like twice already. So, yeah, hopefully, I will film that morning routine the first day of 8th grade online. So, yeah. And, yeah, so it should be like two or three more videos coming out. And I haven't really done a summer morning routine because my summer is pretty fun. But also, I don't really have nothing to film because I just do it on a TikTok. Like, there's no point in me showing 10 minutes of what I do in a day when I can put it into a TikTok for 60 seconds. Okay. So, yeah, that's basically all of my school supplies. So, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and thank you guys for watching. Bye.